we are in a moment where the capacity to act globally, more than ever, is linked to the way we do things internally. So the foreign position or the external position of the European Union is strictly linked to the capacity to act together also in internal uh, matters. And we are at one of those moments when if Europe does not become more united, it will become more disunited. That is why taking consideration the conjunction of different factors, global economic crisis, the financial stability challenges in the euro area, and also the entry now uh, of a new institutional setting, we are in fact in a transitional, some will say also foundational moment. That is why I'm insisting on the points of political will. Because at the end, more than any institutional arrangement, it comes to political leadership. And political leadership not only by the Brussels or Strasbourg institutions, but political leadership by our member states. So I think we should together not miss this opportunity of having a new institutional setting to project our interests and our values in the world. Europeans should be proud of what the European Union is. It represents an aspiration for a world ruled by law and not by force, where rights are more important than strengths and where world powers tackle global problems in concert and not unilaterally. In a very complex 21st century, more than being the best way, this might well be the most realistic way to organize an interdependent world. This is probably the greatest historical achievement of the European Union. It's turned an ideal, a dream, into a political reality.